Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. My name is Andrea and I am here today with a Kroger fill-in haul. I spent $119 and some change and I had a $50 Fetch Rewards gift card. So my total was about, I think $69, I believe that's what I paid. Um, so let me jump right in, got some great deals. So I got these Pringles, they were buy one, get one free, and my four-year-old little boy loves Pringles. My husband likes to eat these tortillas, often with different types of meals, and they were also buy one, get one free. I needed some parsley for recipes, and then I also got four um, russet potatoes, just to have on hand, make baked potatoes or other recipes. I love to keep frozen onions on hand when I don't have fresh onions and I just don't feel like chopping. These are perfect, and I use them in recipes all the time. What I really went to Kroger for was their unsalted butter. Um, is on sale this week, and I got, um, there were two, I think there were $2.29 um, for one pound of butter, which is a fantastic deal. And I'm just gonna throw this butter in my freezer and use it when I need it. I've never had a problem freezing my butter. So I got four unsalted for baking, and then I got one salted uh, that I keep on the counter and we use it to butter bread or whatever else we happen to be using. I bought a jalapeno for a recipe. And then I found some meat on clearance. I love Eck Ridge smoked sausage. And this family size pack, which I believe is three pounds, I got it on sale for $3.96. Originally, it was $10.99, so that's a great deal. Doesn't expire until June. And then I got these two packets of andouille sausage. They don't expire until April 17th and they were on sale for $1.44. They were originally $3.99. I have a lot of Zatarin's rice mixes and other types of Cajun Creole um, box mixes in my pantry that I need to use, and I can use that andouille sausage for that. Got a couple of packets of pasta. Um, these are 12 ounce Skinner, um, and they were a dollar each. I got fettuccine and linguine for a couple of different recipes. I just needed some daisy sour cream. I use it all the time, um, and so I just grabbed some. Um, these chest or pepperidge farm cookies were on sale for $2.99. I got butter and the caramelized crisp. And then I really love bubbly sparkling water. And this is something new that they have out. Um, it's a sparkling water beverage and it's flavored with, a, there's a pineapple tangerine. And I got cherry lemonade, triple berry, and tropical punch. And these were all on sale for a dollar each. Of course they do sell these in the case, but I wanted to try them like this first, just in case I don't like them. They also had some other flavors that I didn't grab. They had a mango, I'm not a big mango person. They had a watermelon mint, I think, and they had one other flavor that just wasn't my cup of tea, so I didn't grab it. Um, I needed some canned corn, so I grabbed two cans of the sweet, super sweet golden corn, and then I grabbed two cans of the chunk chicken and water just for recipes. I really love these Foster Farm crispy takeout wings. They were on sale for $5.99 a bag. Normally, I get these wings from Costco, but I'm not planning on making a trip there anytime soon, so I just grabbed these um, just to kind of hold me over. I grabbed this Tide, it was on clearance. You get 57 pods and it was on sale for, uh, I think it was $15. So I grabbed that, can't beat that. And then another thing that I found on clearance were these Ziploc storage bags. Now I like to have storage bags on hand and freezer bags. Freezer, bag I, freezer bags I use for food and for freezing and things like that. Storage bags, I just use those around the house, around the house, excuse me. But you get 75 of them and they were on sale for $6.62, can't beat that. Um, normally they are $12.99 and normally I get my storage bags from Aldi, but this was a much better deal than just grabbing my storage bags from Aldi. Another thing that was a really great deal this week are these Nature Valley Oatmeal Squares. My son absolutely loves these things. You get 12 bars and they were on sale for $4.99 each. So I grabbed three boxes for him. 
And then another thing that I grabbed is this chimney charcoal starter. So we have a gas grill and we also have a charcoal grill. I really prefer using the gas, I'm sorry, the charcoal grill. My husband prefers the gas, but I always have a hard time figuring out how much charcoal I need. So I grabbed this, this holds the perfect amount of charcoal. It holds up to four pounds, which is typically what you need. You need three to four pounds for, um, to grill. And so I really like this. It was on sale 30% off. I think it was $12.99. And what I really like is on the side here, there's a little lever, there's a little tray. So when you have your charcoal lit and it's ready to go into your grill, you can release it and it just falls out. You don't have to worry about dumping it out or anything like that. So I thought that was pretty good. And that's it. I didn't need any meat. I didn't need fruit, things like that. This is simply just a little fill and haul. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, please make sure to give us a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to our channel, we'd certainly love to have you. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you all next time.